Welcome to the Fermented Homestead. Today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I got two packages in the mail from two super sweet people and I just wanted to go ahead and open them on camera uh, because they're super applicable to the season that we're about to be in. And then we're also going to go ahead and do a 500 subscriber giveaway. I can't even believe that we have 500 subscribers, but I thought it would be pretty cool to get on here and just, you know, say thank you and do a bit of a giveaway. So first thing that we're going to do is the first of the seed haul videos. There will be more coming because yeah. So this first one I already opened and I'm keeping them down here so I don't accidentally show their address. So this first one is from Even the Sparrow Homestead uh, from Jess and Dustin over there. And she just sent me, she went a hog wild, she said, and accidentally bought a bunch of doubles and things like that. And so she sent me uh, quite a few different seed packs. So I just wanted to show you what we got here. There is the Amish paste and then San Marzano and some blue cream berries. I'm super excited to try those ones. Uh, some ground cherries. I love these things. If you guys have never grown ground cherries, they are amazing. And we really enjoy them, but we ran out of seeds. So it's actually perfect timing that she sent those. And then there's a tomato gold, tomato blue gold berries and purple tomatillos. If you guys don't grow tomatillos, it's something you should definitely add to your garden. I've never actually, I've only tasted one tomatillo and they, I didn't like it. Um, my husband says that it wasn't ripe yet. And so I've never actually tasted, I've grown them three separate years and I've never actually tasted one, but these things are just be factories. I mean, it doesn't matter if you like them or not, like just grow them for all of the flowers. The first year that we did it, we actually planted four that were right, um, in, in this row that we had on our, one of our old places that we used to live at. And we had these rows and we just planted four of them and you could hear it from the deck, which was not super close. Like you could just hear the buzz and the hum of all the bees that were just all over that thing. If you are having an issue attracting pollinators, grow tomatillos, they're amazing. And some American uh, Armenian yard long cucumbers. Those things look so cool. I'm excited to try those. They kind of look like loofahs. And then some poblano peppers and some New England sugar pie pumpkins. So I am so excited. And thank you so much, Jess, for sending those to me. I'm just, I'm just so excited. It's so, so cool. It's the first time I ever got anything in the mail and I'm so beyond excited about that. Thank you so much. And then the next one that I have is from Mimsy's Garden, from Anna over there at Mimsy's Garden, my name twin. And I'm sure that probably anybody watching my video probably knows who she is. And oh, she gave me some essential oil samples. Looks like she's with Young Living Essential Oils. I guess if you want some Young Living Essential Oils, she's the gal to get, to get a hold of. And these ones are the peace and calming. I'm excited. I'm going to put it right in that thing right there. I'm just going to read the note real quick. Hang on. Oh, <laughs> she said, <laughs> She sent the essential oils because they'll help with my hiccups. <laughs> She's so sweet. Says to put a drop on the diaphragm. I don't know where your diaphragm is. Down here somewhere. And inhale. <laughs> That's so sweet. Thank you, Anna. So. Wow. Holy smokes. There's so many seeds in here. Okay, let's see if we can do this. There's spaghetti squash. Table queen winter squash. I've never even, I don't even know if I've heard of that. Okay. <laughs> wow, I'm just blown away. I didn't open the package until just now. I was waiting. Um, so black plum tomato. There's no picture, but. Uh, ooh, a bunch of M.I. Gardener. I just found out about, about him. She actually is the one who told me about, about him. And I just, I bought an embarrassing number of seeds from him. <laughs> They're just so cheap. It's so easy to actually just buy them. So I, I did. 
I bought a lot of them from him and from him from uh, Baker Creek. So um, yeah, wow. Okay, and all of his packing, all of his seeds are only 99 cents. I couldn't even believe it. Like every single one of them. Uh, I think there was like a homesteading package that was like $1.99. I'm not sure what the difference was, but I didn't get any of those. I just got a bunch of these. Like, look at this. I mean, 99 cents for 300 cabbage seeds. I mean, these, and there's a bunch of Baker Creek ones in here too. Oh, I just got a sneak peek of some of these. Woo! Okay, so uh, Copenhagen Market Cabbage, which I'm so excited about. You all know how much I love cabbage and um, well, cabbage for sauerkraut, but cabbage is also my favorite vegetable to cook when I can actually consume it. And then there's just, it just says delicious tomato. So hopefully that's gonna be delicious. Ooh, black brandy wine. And Bonnie's best. Beefsteak tomato. Ha <laughs> ha. Home, ooh, homestead, Oops, that's two. Homestead tomato. There we go. And these are all like 30 counts, 25 counts, like for 99 cents. Like this is just great. These are just amazing. Holy smokes. There we go. Oops, I didn't read it. Triple L crop tomato. Tiffin Mennonite tomato. And then Roma tomato. Oh, Blue Lake bush bean. Contender bush bean. Oriental yard long? Ha! Huh? I wanted to order this, but I was too chicken to do that. And then red noodle bean. We're gonna get some beans up in here next this year. Okay, let's see. Uh, squash Yakima Marblehead Hubbard. That looks amazing. I didn't even see that on the site this year. Where did you she got that? And then squash blue Hubbard. These things are behemoth. It says on the back, they're supposed to be 15 to 40 pounds. Wow. And then uh, cabbage of, cabbage of that place. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try. Holy smokes, I can't even believe that. Thank you so much, Jess and Anna. This is just, wow, I can't even believe it. So, okay. So um, what we're gonna do now is I'm just gonna show you what we're gonna go ahead and do for the giveaway. And I don't really know how to do giveaways or anything. I've never done one and um, I've never won one. I've never I've commented on some videos with them, but I just thought it would be kind of neat to do so. And yes, this giveaway came out of my own pocket. It's not sponsored. Nobody sent it to me other than Amazon. As you can see, you know, I ordered it on Amazon. I have one week from today, so I'm gonna post this video on Sunday, which is today. And then one week from today, I'm gonna go ahead and just pick a random winner. One of those like random winner generator things. I'm not cool enough to do like the hat, the name of the hat or anything like that. So hopefully you guys will like this one. I was pretty excited. I don't even have this full actual kit yet. Uh, someday I will get it, but I don't have the whole kit. I just have parts of it. So a little bit of a sneak peek here. This is the 500 subscriber giveaway. It is the full kit it, for the wide mouth jars. And it has the, the little, let me just show you if I can open it without, oh, nope, there's a seal. I'm going to go ahead and maintain the seal on it. So you got this, the stopper here, the, <laughs> the kraut pounder. And then I believe it comes with four of the updated um, weights that are on here. I just have the old style of the weights and then four of these little pickle pipes. So the whole kit here, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to give that away. Uh, we have one week to, uh, what's the date today? I don't even know the date today. So one week from today is February 2nd, 2020. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to pick a winner at some point in time, whenever I feel like sitting down and actually filming a video on uh, next Sunday, the 2nd, February 2nd, we are going to give away this. So if, uh, if you want to be entered to win the Mason Tops fermenting kit, all you have to do is leave a comment in the comment section below with what is the first thing that you would ferment if you were to win a Mason Tops set. So leave that in the comment section below and make sure you give this video a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, bye.